guys, it's your boy, Ty Skids here, and today we're going to be drifting parking A. Now, today is going to be the first day that I actually, like, you know, am able to drift a whole track. So, with the Thrustmaster T300, um, I, I highly recommend getting this wheel because of the fact that you are able to learn how to drift within, like, a couple days using it, as long as you have, like, a decent tune. Now... On this car right here, this is my first no assist tune, but it's not that bad. It's pretty decent, you know. So basically in today's video, I'm just going to be showing you guys my progress on wheels. So this would be day two on T300 with no assist. And the first map I'm going to do is parking A. I don't know what map I'm going to do next, but we'll see. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and check it out. So we are on wheel, as you guys can see. Got the T300 here. We'll go ahead and turn up the brightness for the wheel cam. Okay, all right, so let's go ahead and get started. So what you guys can notice is like, my transitions have gotten a lot better. Oh, oh, it's all good. It's all good. Okay, let's just, let's just restart real quick. I, I, I'm a little nervous. It's the first, the first run, first run, it's all good. First run jitters, we're good, we're good, we're good. All right, we got this, we got this. Okay, we got a little bit of wall taps there, that was kind of crazy. But we didn't crash though, we didn't crash, so... The whole point of this video is to show you guys I can do an entire track without crashing. On that first one, we, on that first one we did kind of mess up a little bit, but... Now as you guys can see, my lines are getting a lot better, transitions are getting smoother. You know, I still got some work to do, obviously, but... Getting a lot better from day one, and then day two, and then now this is day three, so... Let's see if I can throw a 360 for y'all, and then let's try and maybe do like another trick. So yeah, as you guys can see, I've got like 360s down, actually come out of it smooth and whatnot. <laughs> this is crazy, bro. I cannot believe I'm actually like doing this right now. I really can't. Like, <laughs> but it's just that muscle memory and some practice, bro. And you'll get it down. You know? I'm pretty sure pretty soon here I'll be like holding some pretty crazy lines and pretty wide, but in the future, hopefully, my friend, the average track guy, he's on TFS chassis, uh, he was saying that I should try to do like a collab with Team Toretto on the wheel, like Thrustmaster or something like Tandems, like that'd be pretty dope, like some wheel tandem. so I'm gonna hit up, I'm gonna hit up C Toretto and see if he's down, but I'm not gonna hit him up anytime soon, because obviously I need to practice now, but, you know, now a lot of people probably gonna say, oh, you just crashed right there, but like, I already did the whole map without crashing, so y'all can't, can't say nothing. I already did the whole map without crashing, but I honestly just wanted to give you guys like a little update on, you know, my progress, so if you guys did enjoy this video and you guys want to see more content like this, uh, you know, just let me know down below in the comment section. Subscribe, turn on post notifications, drop a like, and um, yeah, if you guys think we should put out the tune to this car in the next video, also let me know too, because I remember you guys asked for like the R34 tune, which I'm still working on that one, that's not that good. But then I started working on the 350Z, and the 350Z is like one of the best uh, no assist, uh, you know, cars. And the reason it says assist on is because I'm using my controller now, but this is with the wheel, so. But yeah, man, other than that, this has been your boy, Tyus Gets Playing Cars, Traverse Online, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.